All right. We'll do that. Okay. We're going to do it, guys. Um... We're gonna do that. Right, so where is it? It's the what'd she say? East side or west side? I think east. I don't know. This one's west. There's a map. Oh god. Which one is the one though? Hmm. Hmm, this town sucks. This town sucks. There's like nothing going on. That's the lab. It's right there. It's right there. Hey, you hear about Wilson? Heard Marauders got him. Just between us? Those are humans. Look like robots. There's some people that are just talking to each other. A friend of mine died a couple weeks back. <gasps> Wrap around goggles. I know how you feel. Mm. Okay, keep it quiet. Keep it quiet. If you're falling sick, I don't want you near me. Don't Whoa. worry. I wouldn't do that to you. What a nice guy. Or Woody. Emerald Vale General Store. That's fine. Hmm. I've always felt weird in here. It's too clean. It's too clean in here. The church, that's why. What's that? OC vial. I don't need that. Why would I pick that up? That's him. Yes, what is it? You're an outsider. Fantastic. Vicar Maximilian de Soto at your service. Or Vicar Max, if you're the sort who prefers brevity. And Ms. Holcomb as well. How rare to see you out. And with a complete stranger. Curious. Hmm. Just tagging along, Vicar DeSoto. Don't mind me. I so rarely get new people to talk to. Name your poison, anything at all. Spiritual counseling, this season's tossball predictions, the quickest way out of town. Um... Parvati wanted to talk to you about what Reed asked us to do. But what? I thought you would talk to him. Hey, what? You wanted to speak to me, Ms. Holcomb? Every time I've tried to engage you in conversation, you look at the floor, answer in single words, and slink away. I would have told him. I can't imagine what would be so grave as to drive her to my mission. What has Mr. Thompson asked you to do? Um... Cut off the power for Adelaine's deserters. Depriving them of safety from the marauders and wildlife. I can see why that troubles you. Miss Holcomb has a soft heart. Always has, if you believe the talk. And who's that? So... What? Um... What do you think of Adelaine's group? They rejected the order of society and live beyond the walls so thoughtfully provided by our Spacer's Choice patrons. Does that strike you as a responsible life choice? Hmm. Assuming your goal is to save as many as possible, then you should bring everyone together. Send the power to Edgewater and convince the deserters to return to the fold. Um... Oh, God. That sounds like I got my work cut out for me. If you don't mind a bit of unsolicited advice, be cautious on your way to the geothermal plant. It is not as safe as you might assume. Why is that? One of the reasons I transferred here was to fulfill my duty in hunting down banned heretical texts. I happen to know such a book is, as we speak, tainting a collector's library in Emerald Vale. However, the collector's residence lies outside the town's walls. What are you talking about? My retrieval efforts have been thwarted by marauders who have overrun the property. 
Should you fare better than me, I'd pay a handsome sum for the book. I don't need money. Uh. Uh. Ooh. It's a handwritten journal, a faded blue cover with the name M. Bakonu handwritten in the lower corner. I'll mark where I saw it on your map. Assuming you're serious? As a side quest. Uh, I don't really want to run errands, but I'll, if I do see it on the way... Thank you. If you retrieve it, you can always find me here. If I see it. There's always some other thing going on with these guys. Hmm. Let's get going. What's your name again? Parvati. Of course. Well, did that go as smoothly as he thought? Yeah, huh? She, she never mentioned her dad. Uh, Mary, did she? Nope. Well, I wanted to ask her what she thought about what he said there. I guess she doesn't care. She doesn't care about it. One day we'll... Maybe we'll talk to them in like just real life, asking questions. So this is where they live. The outcasts. This is it. When I was little, we'd get freighters in every Sunday noon. Now they only come but once a month. I love the wind here. They're right there, so if this town gets attacked, these guys will get attacked too. They're already part of the town, so they might as well contribute to it. Otherwise, they'll die with them. Uh, hmm. Hey, maybe this is not the right place. I don't think it's the right place. It's not the right place. I don't know which objective is that. Hmm. Oh god. How do you exit the map? Oh yeah. What is this one? I'm assuming that's where we go. That's it. I'm gonna go around the town, it's fine. Volcanoes and stuff. I need like a skateboard or something. This is the future. Where's all the cars, man? I wanna drive there. Forget walking there. Running there so 18th century. Oh god. Hmm, damaged mechanical sentry. Searching for repair bay. I could probably fix that. I mean, if you wanted me to. Hmm, I can do it myself. No, I'll let her do it. Go ahead. There we go. Jeremy's good as new. Well, new by Spacer's Choice Standards, anyhow. His name's Jeremy, by the way. Navigation systems operational. Was it? Optimal path toward repair bay detected. Initiating self diagnostics. Um. On account of I fixed him. And he's Jeremy on account of his helmet. It's like Jeremy, the officer in True Romantic Tales of the Space Guard. Um, is that Aetherwave cereal or something? Hebs to Shirley. I make a point to watch every Tuesday night. Be more careful out there, Jeremy. Hmm. Taste the freedom.
interesting. So we out here. I'm not sure what I'm going to do about this quest. We'll, we'll figure it out. Once we start talking to him, we'll understand what to do. Enemies. I'm picking the side route. Oh, God. It was a mine. It was a mine. Gotcha. I like a disarmament. Stun baton, armor pants, mega thing. Stun baton, 89 DPS. Nice. Emerald Val Community Center. Marauder Hooligan. Oh damn, he dodged it. Oh god. That's supposed to order your companions to attack. Don't die. I think she could die in this game. Don't go in there. Dude, she died. I died too. I kind of like that she died. But, uh, well, now now she'll, she'll, she'll be alive again. Oh, shit. Okay. Yay! Alright, so now... Okay. We'll go this way. I don't like that I can spawn back here. I, I wish it was permanent. Kind of. This is too easy now. Evicted. These guys were evicted. Hmm. I'm not going. Let's not go through the town. Just don't even go through it. Now maybe we should. Now they're good guys. They're just chilling. They're in there. Marauders, they're living there. They live there. That's their territory, man. I mean... Hmm. Oh, God. What? Okay, now it's still a little too hard. What? The difficulties are trash. The humans are too easy to kill. The animals kill you easier. I don't know. The bullets, I take more bullet hits than that one ram. I'll do it. One more chance. One more chance there. Hmm. Fuck it. Okay. All right. Oh no. All right, normal mode it is. Yuddy yuddy. Yori yori days. Save. Save every 30 steps. Oh, God. They're everywhere. Do you have dogs, too?
Ups. Everyone all right? Everyone? It's just me. Ring. Save. Interesting. It's fine. <sighs> hmm. Shit. Seems okay. They're way out here. Botanical lab. All right, they seem to be fine. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. Move along. Um, I need some answers from Adeline. Answers, huh? You must be one of those philosophicals. Already got ourselves one of those. No. Uh, well, I mean, I'm, I mean, philosophical. Yeah, I'm into philosophicals, but that, I mean, that's not me right now. Uh, it's about your former workers living out in the wilderness. I'm looking for geothermal plant. Yeah, that's us. And you can tell Thompson we're doing just fine by ourselves. If you're gonna start wandering around my camp, know that I got my sights on you. So you're saying we can wander around? Uh, where can I find Adeline? Over in the hothouse, tending crop. Enough with the questions. No offense, but I've got a lot on my mind. True. You and me both. Uh, uh, hmm. Well, look at you. Buzzing around the Aether with your very own ship. Rest of us gotta make do with the ground at our feet. No, I'm sorry. That was unworthy of me. Lady named Zoe went missing some nights ago. Just up and vanished without a trace. Now I'm pacing around, wondering if Marauders got to her. Hey, Ark Lord, how you doing? Um, I'll keep an eye out. It's not like Zoe to go wandering. Figured she might be out scavenging, but that ain't exactly her talent. Can't imagine where she's gone. Vale's a wide place. She could be anywhere. Vale. I'll find her. Appreciate it. Honest. Well, I, I, I'm not gonna find her, maybe, but... I'll tell you what I can. Uh... Where, she, where is she, though? Vex me. If she told anybody, they ain't telling me. I'd check her room, but I got yelled at for snooping once already. Hmm... Little ways ago, she was always obsessing over her serial dramas. Wanted to see what the fuss was about. How well do you know her? Well, enough to know we never got on. Zoe and Stefan were close. If anybody knows the workings of her mind, he does. Hmm. What is it? Skill points available. Well, we need health. Where's the health? Health. Uh. 
I don't know. Damn, you get a lot of points. Melee power attacks. Uh, <laughs> holding the attack. Okay. Amazing. This is the game of the year. Every day. Better sheath my weapon. Oh gosh. It's so pretty. What is that? Jelly? If you're hungry, there's meat turning on the oh, She's an old outside. lady. If you're barren illness, find a place to lay your head down and I'll fetch you a poultice. Whatever your troubles with Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? She's nice. You must be Adeline. I have been called that, among other things. Green Thumb, Grandmother, the strange old lady who keeps flowers. But yes, Adelaide will do just fine. Excuse me, Miss McDevitt? Sorry, it's just... You got such pretty trees in here. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. Thomas speaks of you often. Are you staying long? You should try some of my tobaccorn tea. I brew it in an old spittoon, but it's been cleaned. Um, yeah, I do want some of that, but I don't have an option for that. Um, is this your greenhouse? No, dear. The garden belongs to us all. Life is the gift of the universe, and the universe yields its bounty equally, absent of prejudice. Um, let's grow tripe in a, I don't know what that means. Both these choices suck. I wish I can just go back. Um, I imagine you grow anything. The soil around the Vale went sour years ago, but I found a way to sweeten it back up. The secret recipe is a little bit of elbow grease, a dash of love, and a heaping pile of special fertilizer. Mm. Made, this, made a home for yourself out here. A home for anyone who's ever turned their backs on Edgewater. A home for those of us with nowhere left to go and nothing to lose. So like the spores of the puffball cast on the wind and alighting on fresh soil, we put down new roots. Uh, you, why'd you leave your home? It is an unpleasant story, dear. But the short of it is that Sometimes one wakes up and realizes the place that was once her home for much of her life has changed. The home in which we spent our lives has left us behind, and so we must move on. And that is as much as I will say on the subject. What product do I use for my hair? Uh, I don't anything. Shampoo, conditioner, and then gel. That's it. You know, I just buy whatever's good price, you know, a good price and whatever's like a good name brand. Not like, not like the store brand, but like something else that you need to recognize because you know people buy it. And that means it's good because if they didn't buy it, it wouldn't be in business. So basically, whatever's a good deal, pretty good deal for you and the company. You know, you both mutually agree, you know, okay, fine, you know. What? You know, I just, you know, that's all I do. Shampoo, conditioner, gel. And hairspray. And I do have L'Oreal. I bought some more the other day. Tresemme. I, I use Tresemme. Because that's the only one that, I think, I don't know why exactly. I just bought it. It must have been a reason. Well, uh, I think it was cheaper. It might have been a sale. Uh, it, oh, it's the, uh, it's the freeze hold why would you buy like a, a not a freeze hold i just like the freeze hold because all you have to do is to make it like not freeze hold just put a little bit and it's like not that much freeze this is the amount the amount you put in there 
is how much hold it's going to be, really, at the end of the day. So you might as well have the strongest one and just put a little bit. That's not that strong. Boom. Life hacks. Reed sent me to make peace with you. Reed Thompson? You here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Oh, no. Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace, then? Uh, you're lifting, you're living off power that belongs to the town. Come back to the cannery. That's about it. Uh, something about coming back to town or losing power. I wasn't really listening. I can't say I blame you. Reed is positively soporific. Like everything else that comes out of Edgewater, what does that, mean? that peace offering is canned. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. But you're living on their power, though. Reed asked me to divert your power over to him. Uh... He would do such a thing. The question is, why would you agree to his plans? Your, your camp has a power regulator. Cannery's got a regulator. You want ship parts, you ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. If you're going down to the plant, you should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. What? Think about it. You'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service to that odious cannery. Seems the sort of thing a hero would do. Cannery? <laughs> what is the is it one or the other? What have you got against the town? You've seen that miserable excuse for a town with your own lamps. Hollowed out workers laboring their lives away at the cannery, living off whatever scrap spacer's choice throws them. But they are living. You know that's true, don't you, Ms. Holcomb? Your father died of overwork. His heart oh, overwork, died. that's a thing. He he was tired all the time, sure, but he was old, ma'am, and he raised me all by his lonesome. He raised what her. They did to if this child. if the cannery the wasn't the company, open, then he may have not have raised her. If the cannery wasn't there, she might have not even been raised. Uh, what? Uh, what you got against people trying to make a living? It's not much of a living. Every single person in that town has sold themselves to Spacer's Choice. The company owns them, body, blood, and bones. You've been there. You've seen it. All anyone ever does is toil over a cannery. They give their lives for some heartless corporation, and then they're tossed into a Spacer's Choice brand cemetery. Hmm. Uh, I guess you have a point. So, what do you say? Divert power over to us. Shut down that abominable cannery for good. I trust you will listen to your conscience. Where are we headed? Uh. Whoa. Personal space. Anything else I can do for you? <laughs> this might sound strange, but I don't know where I am. Um, when we first met, talked to you, assumed I didn't live here? I am getting old, you know. These two lamps of mine are not as bright as they once were. Or I might have seen you for what you are. And what's that? It remains to be seen. Might be the man that saves the veil. Might be Reed's personal gun hand. Hmm. People around here lack the strength to effect change. Or they have the strength, but not the will. You seem to have both. No. Uh, why are you telling me this? Uh, I don't know. A little prattling never hurt anyone, dear. True that. You might even catch a little sense. If you listen close enough, I can't stop you from conducting your business down at the plant. I just want you to know that if you take our power away, you will have brought an end to our way of life. 
Mm. You guys continue this at the town. Not under Reed's watch. He and I would come to blows within a day. And he would never tolerate my tending to a garden. This is my home. It will be my home even if Reed cuts our power. Simple as that. Hmm. You got history. That's because Reed was my boss. I was the cannery's one and only flavor specialist, you see. Remember that limited run of white chocolate cell tuna? That was all me. Um, there's more to it than that. My son worked in that cannery. When the plague started coming, he was one of the first to fall sick. We had a store of medicine locked away, but Reed refused to treat him. Said my boy didn't deserve treatment. Said the medicine would have been wasted on him. Hmm. So I buried my boy in the cemetery, gathered my belongings, and left. That's as much of the story as you need to hear. Hmm. I could not possibly care less if he does. But you're surely welcome to ask him. Hmm. I'm listening. Um. That's not strange at all, dear. Few of us truly know where we are. The world can seem like a forest without end. And it is all too easy to lose one's way. But we must remember that being lost is the first step in discovering yourself. Hmm. Hmm. No, I actually don't know where I am. This is the old botanical lab in Emerald Vale on Terra 2. By the look on your face, I'm guessing you're not quite following me. Are you not feeling well? Ought to lay your head down if you're running fever. Um, my pod landing here. Are you talking about an escape pod of some sort? Where did you say you were from? Um, um, hope? Is that a new settlement of some kind? I haven't kept news from outside the veil. Colony ship. Oh, you're talking about that old piece of folklore. Now I'm convinced you're delirious. You really ought to lay your head down, dear. Babbling only agitates the humors. You ought to try some of my purgative tea. Won't cure what ails you, but it will distract you for a spell. You don't believe me. Maybe I do. I don't know yet. Growing up, I heard my folks talking about the hope. Always believed it was just a story we told ourselves to keep our spirits up. Listen, don't you worry about what I think. That's not important. Worry about what the board thinks of you going around talking about lost ships from decades past. Hmm. I haven't done anything wrong, though. You carry on about coming here from another world, and people will talk. Talk leads to questions. Ask enough questions, and the board comes answering. Mm. What's the board? No, but the board may have reason to fear you. I'm listening. That's all she, that's all she got. That's all she wrote, as they say. Nice garden, bro. Where are we headed? Do you have anything to say about this? Do you have anything to say? You mean about the mission being too clean? It's supposed to be clean as a church. I know, but Vicar says the universe is a machine, that it runs by law. Real machines have gunked up oil, scratches, and worn bits. You can tell they've seen handling, been used by folk. The machine Vicar sees is one that ain't never been run. It's not for people to live in. It's something on a museum shelf under glass. 
uh, it's an ideal, not what we live in. Uh, I've never been much for religion myself. I think there's something higher and greater than us, but I don't feel it when I'm in the mission. All right. Where are we headed? I don't see much of your dad a lot. That's on account of how I never met her. Sorry. It's hard to miss what you never knew. I don't ponder it <laughs> over much. She was in another division of the Spacer's Choice family. She worked in the Vale a few months, sorting the cannery computers. Her contract said any kids she had, expected or not, belonged to her office from the time of conception. So when I was born, I got sent here. Hmm. I don't know about normal. Dad said she worked under some kind of special contract. It's sensible. Dad just fixed machines. She did some kind of crazy math, high-level stuff. Better to raise me on his time than hers. Whoa. Okay. A lot of yapping, not a lot of happening. What is that? The birds. Got it. Heads down. So this is the place they want to get the, cut the power to, huh? This is it. I don't need to sleep. Zoe's journal. I'm not reading that. Uh, take your destiny into your own hands, listen to Grace, uh, this is not a decision, I don't, I'm a gladiator, I'm not a leader for this, so I don't wanna... Fancy duds, do the tubes get in your way? Uh, what are you selling? Fresh off the limb. Merchant skill. Hmm, what is this stuff? Wait, what is that you gun? Hung Fresh. How much do I have? I have 49 bits. Sell. Apples. Um. To sell junk, I guess. Fish sticks. Uh. Sell everything. Healing Enhancer. Mag Packs. Talk to the rooster. Only was third person. The saxophone soundtrack. What is it? So, where's Zoe's room anyway? Zoe's room. Find Zoe. Where is Zoe at? Side quest. Something I can help you with? Uh. Your number one's gone missing. You mean Zoe? Yeah, we were pretty close. Not like her to go loping off. Um. Where is she, though? Zoe and I were going to watch the serials, as is our custom. She never turned up. I looked around, but she was nowhere to be found. You sound like some type of corporate fixer asking all these questions. Hmm. Can't say I recall Zoe ever acting strange. Well, except for her habit of writing things down on scraps of paper. She called it journaling, but I think it's just plain odd. 
Well. Alright. I'm sure she'll turn up somewhere. Something I... Zoe was always obsessed with this cereal. Masked Marketeer. A scion of Byzantium turns to banditry and teaches his marauder companions the wisdom of free market economics. Shame she up and vanished when she did. I had a surprise lined up for her. The other day I got my hands on a genuine copy of the latest Masked Marketeer. I was gonna surprise Zoe with it, but she was gone the next day. Hey, I got time. Hmm. She was gonna join the camp to the east, of course. As was hap that was what was happening. Of course, it was. Botched quests. Oh god, you can actually fail quests though. Zo. Is it Zo or Zoe? It's probably Zo. I don't know. I'm sure she's fine. Oh god. We have a thing. We got a battle. This gun sucks. Oh god. I need to gain some distance. There's so many marauders. might die, I gotta be careful. I repair. Okay. Hmm. We did it. Oh damn, look at this gun. Now this gun looks cool. Thinking Capulet. Increases intelligence. Oh. Power helmet. Now that was cool. The combat. I like the combat. More, more happening. Wish the melee was better. I mean, it's good though. It's not bad so far. So far. We gotta help Zoe though. Oh god. Primal Brute. Holy shit. Nope. I don't think so. Blade of the Immortal. 44 DPS. Condition 92.7%. 68. 100%. Alright. We're just going to ignore those guys. Tamed Conid. Morador. Oh, God. I should, I might tr maybe try to lure those animals to this town. That may be dangerous. You might kill the Zoe. I don't know anybody who ever came out this far. The dog smells us, I think. Oh, good. 
heal. I couldn't heal. I don't know. Okay. Might have to lure those enemies into the town. So how do we save them? Okay, here we go. I tell her just to stop attacking. Stop. Moving. Sorry, won't be right there. Good. I need more heals, man. How do you heal energy? Energy based weapons. How do you do that? How do you do it? Is dead space now? Hmm. So, what do you do with this? Use it. Yo, I'm about to die though. Oh my god. Dude. It's like Skyrim. Okay. Hmm, interesting. Interesting indeed. Hey Zo, how you doing? Wow. You put those marauders in the dirt quicker than the mass marketeer. They're, they're still alive. Teach me your ways. They're still alive, don't worry. Um. What? You mean Adelaide's little congregation of nature-loving nobodies? I could not possibly be less interested in them. You, on the other hand, you were a sight to behold. If I had half your skills, I'd be the greatest outlaw the coast has ever seen. Uh, I'm sent to find you. Why? Adelaide wants me back on garden duty or something? Thanks, but I'm not going anywhere. This is where I belong. Damn. Uh, I'm great at clarifying. Clarify something for me. Uh, why'd you leave the camp? Are you a prisoner here? Uh, I got kicked out of Edgewater on account of falling sick with plague and stealing some medicine to treat myself. I'd heard some outlaws set up camp in the botanical labs. I decided to throw in with them. Seeing as I always wanted to be an outlaw myself. Instead, what do I find? But a bunch of former workers camped out around a greenhouse. I couldn't just go back to the cannery, so I was stuck with them. Hmm. Are you a prisoner? Uh, no. I insinuated myself into their company, see? And they didn't seem to mind one whit. Wit. I've bartered them a few boxes of Adrena time, but yeah, I'm sure that's got nothing to do with it. <clears throat> I don't know. The vital processes that constitute oh, the miracle of life are mysterious and unknowable. Oh, you mean around these guys? The Marauders wouldn't hurt me. They love me. I'm practically their queen. Yeah, it must be my natural charisma. Yeah, maybe the Marauders are the normal people. We're the bad guys. There's, there's like a billion Marauders. They're like the majority of people. I've got all the time in Halcyon. I mean, she wants to live her life here. I mean, 
Ever consider the Marauder life? It's pretty sweet. Just go back. You, you, you can be a Marauder later. I doubt that. Nobody in that camp really cared about me. Oh, okay. Uh, almost defend. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Also, he could carry on a conversation. Unlike these hooligans. I don't want to spoil the surprise. I'll take my stuff and head on back, I suppose. Grace is going to be glaring knives at me. So I've got that to look forward Very to. Very impressionable she is. All right. Oh, God. Wait, I need to get out of here. The Marauders. I didn't kill them. What's the next quest here? How far is this thing? Hmm. Nah. So which one? Well, let's go back here and see what they say now. I'm not sure about the power situation. They really want you to choose right off the bat. Uh, dichotomies. You gotta love them. Hmm. Oops, that's where the, those enemies are. Those weird things. So do we divert the power from the, the garden? But the garden area is going to get overrun. It's very... It's just one spot. Eventually, people are just going to raid it. Like, the town's bigger. The cannery is a bigger place. It's more safer, I'm telling you. It's like a city. This is like a town. I mean, you, you made your trees. Now get on with it. What is it? They're just waiting for, to get attacked. We didn't always get along, but I'm glad to know she's safe. What happened anyway? Uh, they hadn't heard her. Zoe joined up with a band of marauders. Zoe, the same Zoe who doesn't know a barrel from a trigger. Well, I've heard stranger things. Mm. You pretty much did she my said job it. for me. Least I could do is pay you for your trouble. No Let thanks. me know if I can do okay. something for you. Oh, what the hell does that mean? Give me your hat. Zoe says she fought her way out of a marauder camp with her own bare hands. Hmm. I might need some health packs, actually. Something fresh. Where are the health packs? A mod magazine, good amount of ammunition. The ammunition. Uh, I don't have enough. It's very pricey stuff here. Ooh, we gotta get that. That's our new thing we're going for. Oh, we already have something cool. Okay, this game just got cooler. This game just got cooler. Whoa. That's pretty sweet. Are you awake? Home is where the heart is. Marauders took that saying a little too literally. Home is where the heart is. something fresh off the limb well if I divert the power away from this place he might not sell me stuff anymore 91 DPS 105 115 light ammo energy homes where you make you know it reminds me of Fallout New Vegas Ulysses uh, his speech mining gear armor 4 Now we're gonna keep wearing the tube armor. Something I can help. Fresh off. Fresh. Hmm. I don't know, guys. Hmm. 
weapon parts. Power, energy, weapons, weapon parts. Sell junk. Something I can help? Fresh off the... All right, so now... Completed, botched. So do we shut off the geothermal plant? Uh, hmm. Tough decision here. This place looks like it can be overrun pretty easily. I'd rather just not do either and just leave it all. I'm listening. You're listening, but you ain't tough gonna bet it. Oh, that's Thomas. He used to follow me around before he left the cannery. Thomas. Keep your wits about you, friend. Who's Keep Thomas? You, Keep your wits about you, friend. It's not a bad place. I like this place better than the other place. Because the power regulator is broken. It doesn't even work. Just testing. Just testing it. And build your own home. It's like Apex. Mock apple. Well, I don't want to steal it. Are we really going to close the power on this town? We got to choose one. I think we do have to choose one. Do we? So it's, it's one of the main missions. There's more to this town. Ah! ah. There's a lemon tree. Oh, I can't. This is not stealing. These mock apples okay, do not count. Quiet. They don't count as theirs. This could be my house one day. I think if I if I if I, if I side with them, this will be mine. We'll go get we'll go get that guy's book. Then we'll head back to the town and see what that guy says about this, and see. Well, then we'll make our final decision. On who to shut the power on. Ah! It's a tough call. What's going on down here? Is there some sort of dragon in this tunnel? Visible wall. Something in there. Primal behemoth. What in the god name? It's like a gorilla. He's just chilling. There's no reason to kill him. It's like an elephant just chilling in the in the middle of the desert. Like there's no reason to kill him. He's not killing anyone. He's just—he's not ravaging. He could be. So, so what if there's humans around him? Like they could have died later, before he was there. Abandoned outpost. 
Is it though? Or should, can you you can't stealth kill in this game? Here we go. That's a good gun. I need to heal right now. Like I don't have any. Dude, this is like Robocop's gun. Light machine gun. That was pretty sick. Evicted. Holy crap. Now this is me. Now this is my style. I'm gonna wreck their faces off. Hmm. Cannery. Are we back at the town? It's abandoned. Oh god. I must disagree with their theories about the earth. Uh, okay. Gourmet fish. See, if the cannery is overrun, then eventually the botanical gardens is going to get raided too. Collector's letters got a letter today. Corbett ordered me to relocate the Edgewater's cannery. We did it. Hmm. Just upgrade the guns. Upgrade guns. Perks. I don't know. Base health. All right. Should I read that? I mean, I can't bear the part of. Uh, I don't know. I don't know, man. I just don't feel like reading it. I'm not reading nothing. My weakness. I feel like I should, though. <sighs> Looking forward to running my own gift shop from the community center selling rare memorabilia. But scripture tells us that things are happening for... I don't know. I shouldn't have read that. Hmm. Revolver. 94 DPS. 94. 44. 44. Rake. Light machine gun. Hmm. A sentry blade, though. Classic. Oh, it has the flip one. That's that's the trigun type. Now this game's getting better. Now we're going back up the scale. Muzzler. For what one? I don't know. Modifications. Devilish mist. Assault rifle. Jeweled ring. Oh, here we go. This is what Troll Eater was using when I saw him streaming. 
Now we got ammo. Why is she running towards me? That's the last of them. She was diverting their attention, maybe. Pick up everything. Save all the time. My girl was saving all the time. There's always explosive canisters next to them. I never noticed them. Till after I killed them all. That way. I like this gun. This gun kills him instantly. Model space, what was that? Model spaceship. Not sure where I'm going now. Collector had abandoned his. When the collector abandoned his home, he hid the abandoned book at the small cave along the other contraband. There you go. It's a synopsis. I love that reload. You don't see that every day. The top down one. The top down one. Mag packs, cheese, macaroni and cheese, mock pick. Luckily, I have enough. Criminal activities, trespassing, logging, hacking, and murder. All considered illegal activities are frowned upon by Saturday. Avoid being seen with. Clever. It's fine. What? There's no one here to take it, man. It's abandoned stuff. It's abandoned. I want to modify this, but I have to go to the the benches. I want to make a long barrel. Basically, every Destiny pistol ever. Edgewater is way bigger. Diverting the power from this place would be a much bigger loss. Objectively speaking. Like, you would lose this area? Wait, what? I don't understand that. It's kind of stupid. You can always power up the botanical garden later. After this is all taken care of. This is very well secured. This All this power is going to be deleted. I mean, yeah. A friend of mine died a couple weeks back. Still ain't past it. At least you got your health. Damn. Eventually they'll rise up. They'll, 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 they'll go to Congress and tell them that this is not okay. Look, you can dye his hair. In a society like this, they're not so bad because they can dye their hair, man. That's not that bad. Look, this guy can buy goggles that look cool. 
He has, where do you get those wraparound goggles at? Where do you get those wraparound? I've never actually been in here. Seemed scary from the outside. Welcome to the Spacer's Choice Constabulary. We are Halcyon's leading brand in Frontier Justice. The office is writing up promotion. Purchase three criminal investigations and the fourth one's free. Uh, I got questions. As long as your questions fall within the acceptable margins of curiosity. Uh, Phyllis Wills? Who the hell is that? Uh, so who do you work for? Spacer's Choice or Edgewater? If this is a setup to a joke, you should know I've never found anything amusing in my life. I don't serve Edgewater. Edgewater and the entire region of Emerald Vale serves Spacer's Choice. Uh. Hmm. Who did they answer to? Spacer's Choice is a wholly owned subsidiary of Universal Defense Logistics, which occupies a seat on the Halcyon Holdings Corporation, also known as the board. I must admit it bothers me that you don't already know this. Hmm. His likeness decorates many a wanted poster. Do you have any relevant information about this individual? Uh. He shot me into space. You are correct. An outstanding bounty okay, has been posted her. for information pertaining to the whereabouts of Phineas V. Wells. She's too, uh, she's too into the, into the Matrix. Oh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing that. Interesting jumpsuit you've got. Oh, true. By interesting, I mean suspiciously reminiscent of contraband. Oh, really? I shouldn't be wearing, actually, I shouldn't be wearing this outfit. As a Spacer's Choice Constable, I am authorized to grant you legal authority toward apprehending wanted criminals. Know how to carry yourself in a fight? I've got bounties out for these three marauders. Cross them off and bring me their fingers. Just one per marauder, please. I'll dust off the old fingerprint roller. I'm not doing that. The marauders might be good guys in like a weird situation. It's like the Matrix. They're like, you never know. Just leave them alone unless we have to deal with them. Been eating nothing but salt tuna for a year. I've got some time. That's there's Blaine. El Cildor's heir. Oh, I'm an actuary. That means I keep tabs on a worker's living expenses. How much it costs to feed, clothe, shelter, bury, and replace your average human worker. Technically, I'm employed by the Spacer's Choice Department of Human Resources. Hmm. Another day at the cannery. Don't go knocking your work. At least we've got one. You're not a big drinker. Oh, here we right? go. Not at all. See, the workers are having fun on their time off. They're fine. You read the latest report? Only the part that said we ain't making our quotas. If only McDonald's had expanded us, the cannery could use those extra hands. Nothing yeah. we can do about that. Sure there is. We can have another zero G. I don't know you. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Uh. <coughs> I'm this gay. Amelia Kim, Spacer's Choice Beverage Dispenser. I don't know what you're about, but this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal, hardworking company folk here. Hmm. Something going on here, and what a fine establishment it is. I'll say charm. Yeah. You really think so? It is. It That's is nice. kind of you. It is. it is. I've been trying to keep the floors clean. It you is got nice. No idea how long it takes to scrub the tiles. Hmm. Guess I misreckoned you. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to be curt. 
We just got some problems lately. Random words. I can get you a drink if you'd like. Gotta ask you to enjoy your beverage within the premises, though. Can't risk you bringing a drink over to those deserters. You understand. That's pretty far from here, though. Uh, yeah, Reed mentioned those deserters. <laughs> Traitors. The lot of them. Mm. Bunch of folks decided they were tired of working and went out into the wilds to fend for their own selves. The town's already struggling to make quotas, even without that band of slackwits abandoning their posts. Bunch of lazy, shiftless rung leeches. Anyway, enough about them. What can I do for you? You know, Edgewater could have cut their power at any time, so they're really nice in letting them have their power for so long. Without me intervening. That's the that's that's what's going on here. Coming right up. Give me a drink. Uh, pure oh, that's pure water. Zero G brew made in space. Water without the hydrogen or oxygen. Dehydrated water. What the hell? Trip tease. Water without the hydrogen or oxygen. Sugary drink. Last 30 seconds. They're all the same price, damn it. That's pretty expensive, I must say. But I'll buy the damn tea. No, thank you. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm contractually obligated to recite company slogans to any <laughs> visitors. We'll get you mostly drunk at half the price. Spacer's choice. Hmm. I'll be on my way. I'll drink it here. That's RP. Oh, is he actually doing it? Hey, this spacesuit's kind of out there wearing it around people. There you go. Now I'm a normal guy. I'm a normal guy now. Hmm. She'll let me back here. It's fine. <gasps> Sink's leaking. This is not, this is up for grabs. Parkour. Damn it. Damn, now I kind of do want to go up there. One more try. Whoops. Sounds so much like the Trigun Badlands Rumble soundtrack. It's right there. We did it. Ordens Control Helmet. Damn. Nah, tempting though. Whose house is this? A shower? Oh shit. I actually broke in someone's house. I don't need that helmet. I don't need it. Uh, can we not get out of here? Uh oh. Wait a minute. Beats were stuck here forever. It's broken. Arbiscus, I, I kind of don't like it, but there's some things I do like about it. 
One thing I don't like about it is I'm stuck right now. You can't get out of here. There's no way out of here now. Once it, I, I parkoured my way in. Uh, shit. But I do like... I'm getting into the story. Uh, I do like the combat. I like the guns. The different guns they got. I definitely like this gun. I need to modify this. It's like Vash's gun where it flips open. It flips. I got it from a uh, Xbox Game Pass. I Game Pass. I already had the pass. It has the, this has the flip reload. I love that shit. It's not all the revolvers do that in the games. Wonder if the plague's ever gonna pass. So I do like Keep that. Working. It reminds me of Trigun a lot. So that's really good. That's that's really carrying the whole game for me right now. Any progress on that matter we discussed? I got your book right here, and I said the words basically. Wonderful. This is fantastic. Well worth all the sacrifices I... Wait. What the fuck is this? Is this... French? I can't fucking read French. It's a law-forsaken joke is what it is. French. Ha! I was so high and mighty, preaching to the yokels about following the plan while fighting it at every turn. Huh? You don't want that book to keep others from reading it? You just wanted it for yourself? You're overacting a bit, don't you think? What's so important about this book? I've spent my life searching for the keys to unlocking the secrets of the universal equation that underlies the plan. I had hoped this book held some of those answers. I became so desperate, I even got myself assigned to this plague-ridden backwater to find the damn thing. All the time and suffering I've spent. Wasted. So what is he going to do now? At least you still have your mission to work here to give your life a meaningful purpose. Uh, what do you think the book held? The secrets you were looking for? Um, what kind of secrets were you expecting? Bokonu, the author, had some uh, interesting why? theories about man's perception of reality that I thought could be applied to our attempts to decipher the plan. Unfortunately, he was also one of the founders of the Philosophist School of Thought, so the book is banned in this colony. What? I don't get it. I'm lost. At least you can still do that here. Please. As if my life should have no greater meaning than proselytizing to a bunch of feeble-minded wretches. Nothing could be more Rude. excruciating than discussing the true nature of reality with people who have no interest beyond their next Aetherwave program. But that's neither here nor there. They watch Aetherwave? What I need to do now is to find a translator, obviously. But to do that, I'll first need to secure transport. You have a ship. Perhaps I could make myself of use to your crew. Uh... You need to ride out of town. I wouldn't mind a ship hand. What's in it for me? Free spiritual counseling, someone to watch your back, not to mention a grown up in the party. I'm 28. Oh, exactly. What? I'm pretty handy with a toss ball stick, or any blunt instrument, really. I'm also a passable gun hand if it comes to that. I can usually talk to I like my this way game. Conflict, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Oh. I'm fairly competent at hacking computers as well. It's growing on me. Uh, it's growing on me. I don't want to. I don't want to take him because I know he'll probably die eventually. Dude, these people, my followers, are gonna die. I know. <laughs> There's gonna be a part in the game where like they just start dying. Whatever, it's fine. What else are they gonna do? Sounds good. Fantastic. Let me get my things in order and I'll catch up with you. Edgewater's gonna miss you. Folk here always had good things to say about their vicar. Thank you, Ms. Holcomb. I'll be glad for the change of scenery and to leave this place behind. This guy's a dick. I shall see you on the ship, Captain, whenever you're ready to leave Emerald Vale. Actually, I, I kind of don't want to take him. He's kind of sketchy, actually. Whatever. Well, he's, he wants to move on to bigger and better things. That's kind of, I understand that, you know. You know, he did all he, he... He reached level 100 here. He wants to move on to the next game. Hey there, Mary. 
don't see you around here too He wants long. to move on. Oh, and I level up again. To talk to the vicar is all. He already maxed out yeah, this area. You know, you yeah. can't blame him for that. So you got you got to take Deserting, are you? He loves it ish. What? Let me see this no, clip. No, 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 no. And I it has the, this has the flip reload. Perfect. Do excuse me. I, must I love that shit. That's basically Spirit the whole game. Excuse. That's that's the whole review. Has the, this has the flip reload. That's the whole review for the game. <laughs> Alright, so that's good. So I just think I'm deciding which side to side on. I think this I'm gonna keep this town with power. I'm gonna leave that's like ask they're asking me right now, am I gonna leave New York City powered up? Or am I gonna sh or am I gonna leave uh, Johnny B. Goods Bar and Grill powered up? One of them has to go. Of course I'm gonna leave the city powered up. Jesus. Let me talk to the mayor though one more time. Just to make sure. I mean, this place does suck, but I mean, um, eventually someone will Sorry. come I'll just be a and make things better. Er? Better er? Don't shut down the whole city just because, like, ten people don't like it. Or some shit. Now, where's that workbench at? Where's that workbench? I want to upgrade this gun. If I, there's, there's got to be a long barrel in this game for that gun. If there's not, then that's a missed opportunity. Oh god. I don't know what the hell that was. Terminals. Uh, I don't know. I'm not reading that. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a gunslinger. I'm not a reader. Just gotta keep our heads up. Oh, it's a cannery. This is non-vegan. Now, wait, that, that changes things. It's not vegan. Wait, is that what this is all about? One area is pla like plant-based. This other place is animal-based. Is that what's going on? Meat versus plants. Oh god, now what do we do? Well, I don't know. It's hard to say. Now what? That makes it different. Well, people need to eat though. People, oh, plasma cutter, look at this thing. I need to be level, s I don't want to steal it, but no one's going to use it. No one's going to use it. Nah, I'll get one eventually, I'm sure. I'll find one eventually. Temptation. Deliver us from evil. Hmm. How do you get out of here? I'm just looking for the workbench. I'm lost. I hate to shut down the power for any side. But this is the more objective side to side with. For the good of thousands more. Potentially. Is there a map here? How do I get upstairs? Saltuna. Yes. That's a good way to kill time. In the bar? When I asked if you were a drinker? He sounded worried. Sorry. I know it's none of my business. Uh, I like a drink now and again. It doesn't make me an alcoholic, okay? It's not like I think it a failing, mind. It's just I... I live right across the road. Most nights I watch folks out my window. Mm. When they come in here, they might be happy or sad. Mostly they're tired. 
When they leave, they're mad at themselves. Or they stumble into the alley and I listen to their hearts breaking. Relax, babe. They didn't invent Twitter yet. I can't abide someone who can't handle their liquor. That's, that's just rude. That's just gatekeeping. Are you safe living across from this place? I'm not even in the bar anymore. Sounds like folk here lives hard lives. Live hard lives. Maybe so. But we don't think on it that way. They don't think about it like that. They're proud of it. If you could see your way to getting us our power back, I'd appreciate it. Um, uh, talk about something. Go ahead. Uh, have you taken a look at the town? It is my job to keep two eyes on my town. I am the steward of this place, and this is my watch post. How long have you worked here? I'm trying to remember 25 years, 26. When you get to my age, the years just rush by. You stop counting altogether. I remember looking out this window and seeing the veils spread out from horizon to horizon. We were a sprawling town. We were booming. Times change. People change. But the veil will always be here. The Spacer's veil? choice will always be here. Our work won't ever end. I take comfort Bitch. in that. Um, you're loyal to Spacer's Choice? This is a Spacer's Choice town. We're all part of the Spacer's Choice family. It sounds like William Shatner. The company keeps us warm, keeps us fed, keeps us working. Loyalty's got nothing to do with it, friend. This is good old-fashioned gratitude. You know, forget this stupid Pokemon. He's, he's too far away. Uh, loyalty's not going to do... Hmm. Gratitude. It's falling to pieces. I wish you wouldn't say things like that. You disagree? Yes, as a matter of fact. When I stand at my window and look out over my town, here's what I see. I see decent, loyal, hard-working people. I see a family. We are all part of the Spacer's Choice. He's not working. We are all doing what we were brought into this you world to do. Look at the, you don't look as hard as those guys. I can't say that, though. There's no option for that. Go ahead. We need to have a word about this plague. You seem to be fixed on bringing Adeline back to town. What makes you think you convinced the deserters to come back? That you are not one of us may work to your advantage. Adelaide and her folk loathed the people of Edgewater, you see. I admit the fault was mine. I'm about as diplomatic as a bristling canid. I just hope Adelaide and her folk will see their way past my flaws and return to town. Mm. I can't pay attention to both games. Uh, I admit the fault was mine. Hmm. Of course people go. Yeah, this is an ugly place to live. I mean, it's not bad, though. Sometimes people move on. Scripture tells us we all have our purpose in the world. Our work shows us that purpose. We should not have to move on from it. Yes, we have lost good workers to desertion. We have lost even more to plague. But it is why we must square our shoulders and carry on. You and Adeline had a personal history? Losing Adelaide was the hardest. She was our only flavor specialist. When she walked away, I knew we were in trouble. Spacer's Choice Saltuna is renowned across the system for its quality flavors and additives. We used to sell citrus-flavored Saltuna in our heyday. Ever since Adelaide left, we have been reduced to selling unflavored and spearmint. It's like vapor. It's like vape. Go ahead. Um, why is she the only one who knows how to do it? Adelaide was our only flavor specialist. We are a Saltuna canning institution. Saltuna without flavor is like a cysty pig without tumors, borderline inedible. 
Uh, don't you people eat any anything other than tuna? Word up to me, friend. I'd stack our larders with saltuna galore. No other brand of saltuna adds as much vim or vigor to the body's humors. But, and this is something we must keep between the two of us, saltuna is hard to come by. What with being a species indigenous to the seas of another world. Wait, so what are you canning here exactly? Wait, what? Oh, we've scavenged together some organic material from the surrounding environs. Mostly organic, organic mostly local mushrooms. Some of which possess a texture akin to a well-boiled slab of saltuna. The difference is all but impossible to detect <clears throat> to any but the prissiest of palate. That's kind of good, though, because that's not all bad. It's, not, it's, it's kind of like vegan, but like they're not telling them, though, which is bad, though. Go ahead. What's the plague? Can we not? Talking about unpleasant things always gets my bile up. That was me, by the way. What plague? I forgot what we were talking about. I don't know. I forgot, I forgot about the plague. I'm not sure what that means, but I'll pretend like I remember. Yes, the plague. You, yes, I know. I think I know what's going on. You withhold me medicine from our workers. If I had enough medicine to treat everyone who fell sick, I would, but I don't. I mm. can't save everyone. Understandable. So I have to choose. You are, Just you? That can't be easy for you. It is not easy for me. And the moment it becomes easy is the moment I am no longer fit to serve. He's William Shatner. Spacer's choice is a family. And the survival of the family is more important than the survival of the individual. Mm, that's, I mean, that's logically true. I mean, I think that's, I've heard, you know, you guys say if you save a thousand people versus one person, I mean, let me, t but what if the thousand people suffer and the one person's like happy as hell? Hmm. Well, actually, uh, how long has this plague been happening? That I cannot say. There was no moment when the plagues they're, began. They're fine, though. Disease there. always lurks on the fringes of society, Monero. waiting to infect the idle and the lethargic. But in the last ten years, the plagues have become progressively worse and increasingly frequent. The plague. You should have developed an immunity after repeated exposure of a single strain of contagion. Things have been going badly. Wait, so something else is going on then. Corporate doesn't like us using the word should. It encourages the imagination. I believe plague is a test. It is a test of our loyalty and our fortitude. And it is one we will see through to the end. What is the plague business? Go ahead. That's it. Can we not? That's it. Something on your mind. I shouldn't have said that. Never say, never say the thing that gives you more XP. Say what you mean. Go ahead. That's all we could say to him. Damn, I messed it up. Something on your mind. Go ahead. The I must. The burden of leadership is responsibility. If my workers walked out on Edgewater, then I have failed them. Yes, we have lost good workers to desertion. We have lost even more to plague. But it is why we must square our shoulders and carry on. Uh. Go ahead. That you are not. I admit the. Nature is uglier. There is safety. Yes, here. two things. For that. Safety and purpose. But not all of us see that, and I cannot force that vision upon them. Yes, we have lost good workers to desertion. We have lost even more. T mm. All righty then. What could be in there? Yeah, huh? Well, I guess I'm gonna cut the power to the other place. That's kind of stupid. That's nah, alright. It'll be alright. I mean, I really just don't want to do either, but I think you have to. It's part of the quest. It's 
It's part of the meme. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Titus. Androidus. Where is it? He's over there. No way. Enemies? No. Okay. Oh yeah, we got a lot of ammo, we got a lot of guns. Good combo. It's never straightforward. There's always something in the way. Primal Ravager. Got it. Heads down. I don't want to fight those things. I mean, I could. Oh, God. The power plant. The power plant is just right over here, like it's un unprotected. I always wanted to poke around in here. Oh, sorry. Here they come. Oh no. I think I saw a troll doing this. attack this base though it'll be vulnerable though joint actuator is that a melee weapon nope okay system incoming hmm Raiders trying to get in here. This explosive barrel. Scientist dead. Gyrosite speed grip. Bunch of stuff. The dogs were dead as well. Secrets. Easy. The loot save. All together. That works. Heading back. Retreat. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. Are you okay? I'm not sure what that is. The birds. Corporation Service Award. Medium says award. That's oh, mine now. Oh, shit, he's like fully armored. Bracelet. Vending machine discovered. What's the big deal about the vending machines? Scientists, they don't get naked when you take their outfit in this one. 
What's the big deal about this? Why do I care? My, my armor. Elite troop armor. Riot control helmet. Hmm. Nah. Oh! They sell a lot of stuff here. They got some shotgun. A sawed off shotgun. Now you're talking my language. I gotta get me one of those. I should buy one of these too. Is it heavy? It's light. Hmm. Oh my god. I'm Mega Man. I'm Mega Man. Hmm. I want to save the, the machine gun ammo till later. Sweet. Hey, it's a double barrel. This is one barrel. Free loot. Construction mechanical. At least the fence is still up. From the planet to your living room. Vending machine discovered. The control room should be off to the right. Wait. Gyrosite. Doing the right thing. The right thing. Processing. That's not working. That's not working either. All these guns are trash. You need the machine guns. Or this giant melee weapon. That works. Kind of, not really. That doesn't really work that well. Oh god, she's dying. Where are we headed? You're dying. I hope she doesn't die. I like her, actually. It's pretty cool. Reload the gun. I gotta take out the big guns for this. There's no messing around. This is life or death situation. Not for me, but the girl. Um. Uh. Hmm. Spacer's choice. I don't know. It is a hard decision. You could just destroy the whole plant and let them all fend for themselves. Or not do that. You know, they could do that later. And just don't be the cause of that right now. I don't know. But when then? If not now, when? Wait. Oh god. I was hoping there was more distractions.
one, the biotechnical lab, or the other place. Something you need? Yeah, your your help your help on this one. Plant status. Spacer's choice. Spacer's choice isn't actually an entity. It's 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 just a thing. It's not actually people. I think is they, I think it's just people think it's people, but it's all, it's it's the people who think it's the people. Mm. Emerald Vale plant, twenty-two percent power is being distributed to Edgewater. Botanical laboratory. Structural damage detected. Please notify. It. Can we fix the plant somehow? Probably not. Probably not. I don't think we can. Maybe if you open... God. Doesn't say the company's been replacing our guards with auto mechanicals. Hmm. Mechanicals gone crazy. Locked myself down here. I know the code. Obviously. Heavy ammo. We're, we're, we might actually fix the plant. We don't have to do it. Give me that award. Stolen Valor. I'm War Machine. This is War Machine Simulator. Whisper Quiet Muzzle. Save. Oh. Incoming. No problem. Plenty of ammo. They killed all the humans. Plant worker. Hmm. Batman wouldn't make. Batman wouldn't choose so rashly what to do here. We can fix the plant and have everyone have power. I believe. There's always another way, or just don't do anything for now. But we have to progress the story, so... But hopefully this... I think we're getting somewhere. I think we're getting somewhere. Hmm. The core is going to probably break eventually. Like, lose power overall, and they'll both lose. So you got to take care of it. Self-diagnostics complete. Navigation systems <clears throat> operational. Combat systems operational. It's not the best choice. It's the spacer's choice. Why aren't you attacking me? Hostile actions towards spacer's choice. Mechanics are contrary to logical directive. Conclusion. All hostile auto mechanicals must be defective in compliance with spacer's choice policy. All defective auto mechanicals must be permanently dismantled. 
please allow me to assist. You want me to help destroy your other mechanicals? Affirmative. Mechanicide protocols loaded. Awaiting confirmation. All right, man. Mechanicide protocols currently active. Team of technicians conduct complete refit. Finish routine. Maintenance. There's a lot of heavy ammo here. Hey, hastily written note. Borrowed a copy of the Young Spacer's Guide to Mechanical Engineering. I think it's volume three. I need something to read down in the pit. Much obliged. What the hell's going on? It's J5. These guys are cute, actually. But they're not using... They're not killing them when they make the, the tuna. It's like mushrooms. It's secretly vegan. Flywheel. Hmm. Oh, God. Gotta help that guy. Get away! We don't have much time, I think. None steam. You're liable to get scalded. Processing unexpected. Holy crap. Canyon leveled up. That's cool. Oh! All unranged. Companion ledger. Hmm. Well, let's give her a better gun, I guess. Melee weapon's pretty good, though. Yeah. I think I maxed the melee out. It's bottle capped or something. Bottle neck. Shut off the steam. Scientist Workbench finally All right Install mod What is this? Magazine Changes it to plasma. No, I don't want that. Plasma. Maybe. No. I have all those. It could change this to plasma too. I don't know how much plasma ammo I have exactly. Tinker repair breakdown. Weapon parts. 44 shovel 73 hmm Helmets. Hibernation suit. That's pretty cool. You gotta keep that. 120 DPS. Yeah, give her the pistol. The pistol's pretty good. Just let her keep that. I won't install the mod after all. I'm gonna keep it. 
I'm gonna keep it for a while. What does that mean? I'm repairing it, I think. Hopefully. Front performing. Here they come! Oh god. Oh shit, I'm out of ammo. Now it's the real shit. Stop running in front of my stats. of heavy ammo this changes things there was that one guy who was screaming for help we should probably help him uh, let me go help that guy actually you never know if he's gonna die eventually if you don't help him he probably already did he's probably already dead I'm Jeremy. Gotta You're find not him. Real. You're not real. He has to know something about this. Stupid how you know his name. Higgins. How do I know his name is Higgins? You're not real. You're not real. Get away from me, Phantom. Shoot. Scram. Uh, calm down. You can talk? The Phantom's never talked before. I knew I shouldn't have eaten that sprat raw. See? See, Higgins? This is why you must always boil your sprats before ingesting. Uh, what's going on? Clearly, I mistook you for one of the phantoms of my imagination, which yep. terrorized me on occasion. Okay. Chester D. Higgins. The D stands for definitely not insane. I use it as a reminder. What is it you do here? Oh, Higgins has been many things over the years. Sprat Wrangler, Saltuna Critic, Aetherwave Personality, Chairman of the Board, Galactic Defender, Sisty Pig Tycoon. I've come a long way for someone who started off as a simple engineer right here in this plant. Did he program all that robots to kill everybody? What happened to this place? Mechanicals lost their bolts. Opened fire on anything that moved. It was pandemonium. And you weren't killed? I was on cleaning duty at the time. My old boss had me scrubbing pipes when the killing started. So, as usual, I missed out. You didn't starve? Jimmy'd opened the vending machines. That lasted a good couple of months. Eventually, I had to resort to more unconventional means of filling my insides. Great sprats. Braised. Boiled. Charred. Skewered. Sprats are good eating, friend. Chock full of brain food. Hmm. Sure. You're an engineer. I specialized in auto mechanicals, drones, sentries. Repaired them, maintained, upgraded. Did it all from my old workroom, just over in the next section. You must have know to stop them. Look, I don't want to fall into any trouble with the mechanicals. If they wise up to our plans, they will come for us. With prodding irons. Bruh. I can deal with them. I can't do that. Bruh. What's eating you? The tail. Definitely start with the tail. If you're feeling adventurous, the ears are a particular delicacy. I can't persuade him. Jimmy'd opened the vending machines. That lasted a good couple of months. He said that already. 
Well, yes, for the un- Braised. Oh, before. Definitely before. Sis um... Damn. Damn it. Uh, that sucks. Hmm. Oh, well, we're on our own then. Guide to mechanical engineering. I have a guide to mechanical engineering. Monkey, how's it going? How's it going? Oh, I need more talky talky power to get him to help us so we're on our own. Is that a focus? Oh, shit. Is it better now? Is it better now? I don't think it was like that for long. I think that just happened. So now we're on our own, of course. Thanks, monkey. So are you. You're pretty cool too. Now let's go kill these robots. That's Jeremy. He's going to help us back to business. Better than... Uh, I'd say no. But it's not bad. It's not that bad. You should play it. You should stream it or play it. Just play it. I think that's good. I think it's good to play a little bit. See if you like it. If you have the game pass. Oh, it's barred. What does that mean? Okay. Good thing I tried again. Good thing I tried more. Well, there were, I think I was already in here. That's not good. That's not a good sign. That means we're at the end of the road. Oh, pick a white machine gun. Oh, this is the key we need to open a thing we need to get into. Now we just need to find that door. Hope is not lost. This place is huge. BL3? Oh, Borderlands 3. Have you been playing that? Or not yet? This is how we, I think it's the exit of the lab. Oh! Well, there's like a cache, that's it. I should have saved some uh, perk points. Always save perk points. Twenty twenty one. Oh damn. I can get it free if you really need if you really need money. I could, Smonky. Save you I could save you two years of your life. With sixty dollars. Sixty dollars for two years of waiting? I mean that's a that's a easy. That's a GG.
I think we can't do anything else until we, if we level up more. Maybe. Seems like that's it. There's a map. E2. Currently active. Please. I need to level up a little more. Wait, maybe not. Night Harbiscus. I need to get off too. I don't want to rush this just because I have no time left. So we might have to call it here at the level up next time and uh, get the persuasion perk up. Once we do this, there's no going back. Hey, mister. Look, I know you want your power regulator and all, but I just got to ask you. Do you understand what you're about to do? What's your opinion? I don't think you should cut off Edgewater's power. I think it would be cruel. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I I'm sorry. That just sort of came out all at once. Edgewater's hurting. We've been losing workers year after year, and corporate hardly ever sends replacements. There's barely enough Saltuna to fill our bellies anymore. But the town's got some good people in it. Decent, hard-working folk just living their lives the only way they know how. They don't deserve to be punished. That's true. Reed tells me Edgewater is going to die without workers in power. Well, that sure sounds like Mr. Thompson. If he was standing here, I imagine he'd remind us of how we're all one big, happy Spacer's Choice family. In Mr. Thompson's eyes, those funky. deserters are still part of the Spacer's Choice family. The family must work together in order to survive. I hate to say it, but I think Mr. Thompson's got a point. Unless those deserters come back, Edgewater's as good as dead. Cutting off their power might be the only way. Yep. Otherwise, what else? We're going to go to botanical gardens and die from a raid of one day? Miss McDevitt's built something beautiful. Somehow, she's talked the ground into giving life again. She can do it again. It's later. plain to see she's made the Vale a better place. Fed the hungry, tended the sick. Gave a home to those that had none. But Miss McDevitt delights in Edgewater's suffering. She wants to hurt the town. Mm. Do you really want to be party to that kind of hatred? Vengeance. Sorry, I didn't mean to babble on like that. I just... I felt like I had to say something. Well, it is the fate of millions of human lives. Don't worry about it. I was barely listening to you. Really? I mean, wow. Thanks. I, no one's ever told me those words in that order. Bruh. What is 22% efficiency still? That is ridiculous. Oh, we'll come back another day. Hmm. These pipes. Oh. Interesting. Yeah, 
Yeah, I gotta, I gotta get back to this later. I need, to, I need that guy to help us fix the plant. We need to fix the plant. There's another way. We'll just come back, level up, go back to that guy, and finish the jab. 